Hey y'all, it's Ms. Naylor. We're going to be talking about the roots on page 86 of your book tonight. So if you will grab your highlighter and your pen or pencil, turn to page 86. Our root is meter, or meter, it means measure. And our first word is barometer. Barometer is made up of two roots. Bar means pressure, and meter, of course, means measure. So a barometer is an instrument for measuring atmospheric pressure and for assisting in predicting probable weather changes. And you can see that barometer right there in the corner. Make sure you highlight the root bar as well. Geometry is made up of two roots, geo meaning earth and meter meaning, of course, measure. Um, originally, geometry literally meant earth measuring, of course, and it was the system of measuring distances on Earth through the use of angles. So that using angles to figure out how far apart things were, that kind of thing. Now though, geometry really just refers to the branch of mathematics that deals with points, lines, planes, and solids. A kilometer, kilo means thousand, and meter means measure. So a kilometer is just a thousand meters or about 0.62 miles. Um, if you've ever traveled abroad and seen speed limit signs and thought, wow, that's really fast, um, like this one, 50 kilometers an hour for an area where children play, it's because, of course, a kil kilometer isn't as far as a mile, and so 50 kilometers an hour isn't as fast as 50 miles an hour. Metric system. The metric system is a decimal system based on the meter as a unit length, and the kilogram as a unit mass. Um, we here in the United States do not use the metric system, which other people tend to find highly entertaining because almost the entire rest of the world does. Uh, and I have a really great little comic sketch for you here about that. It's sad, man. The only people use the metric system are doctors, right? And, and I feel sorry for the doctors because they have to give us our diagnosis in fruit. You go to the doctor and they say, oh, you have, you have a tumor. Oh, okay, how big is that? <laughs> Nine centimeters. And then you got to look at the doctor and look at his face to try to figure out how bad it is. You're like... Thank you, Wanda Sykes, for telling us about the metric system. Um, the next word is metronome. So again, measure, and then no means law. The reason a metronome and that that root for law, gnome, is in there is because um, it has to do with the law of music. So metronome is a clock-like instrument for measuring the exact time or the law um, of music. Uh, you've probably seen them before if you're in a choir or band or orchestra, anything like that, and you're probably familiar with this sound. Our next word is odometer. Um, the odometer is road and meter, so ode for road and meter for measure. It's an instrument that measures the distance traveled by a vehicle. And if you look here, we have um, the odometer in the bottom section. It's right here. It's that part that tells your parents how far their car has gone. Parameter is, again, two roots. We've got a lot of roots here, so I hope you're highlighting as we go. Para means beside, and um, it has to do with the fixed limit or boundary. And when we say parameter, it could be a physical parameter, so the four walls of my room make up the parameter, the limits or boundaries of my classroom. But it could also mean um, a different kind of parameter, a different kind of boundary, like rules are parameters. We talk about the parameters of a budget, so how much money you can or can't spend. A pedometer is an instrument that measures the distance walked by recording the number of steps taken. You sometimes see people um, wear these on their belts when they walk, and every time it moves, it counts a step. It's made up of two roots, ped for foot, and then of course meter for measure. So it measures how far your feet go. Perimeter is the boundary of around an area. So 
parameter are the actual boundaries. Perimeter is, has to do with the distance around, because peri means around. And you will never ever forget what perimeter is after watching this. Now that we learned how to measure in centimeters and meters, uh -huh. and we talked about inches and feet, that's right. Now we're gonna talk about the perimeter. You have to measure each side, each side, add them up, and we find perimeter, perimeter. That's perimeter. Perimeter, perimeter. That's perimeter. The perimeter. You have to measure each side, each side, add them up, and we find perimeter, perimeter. I hope that's stuck in your head for a really long time, guys. Um, symmetrical, again, two roots. Meter meaning measure and sim meaning together. Uh, means measured together, technically. Really and truly, we think of it as having both sides exactly alike. So both of these pictures have are, are symmetrical in some way. If you fold them in half one way, the sides would be exactly alike. A tachometer um, is a measure for speed, but we have tachometers in our car and they're not the part that measures how fast you're going or how fast the car is moving. It's actually what measures how fast the engine is turning. So a tachometer is an instrument used to measure the speed of a revolving shaft in revolutions per minute. Um, I'm going to show you a video where you'll see the tachometer light up. The left side is the part that tells how fast the car is moving. So that's where the miles per hour are. And on the right is the tachometer, which is how fast the engine is moving in revolutions per minute. Right, so last night we uh, noticed a new feature in the newer generation my color gauges in the Mustangs. The tachometer will actually turn red when we get to the red line. I'll go ahead and uh, show you guys. And our last word for this week includes three roots. So we have meter for measure, try for three, and gone for angle. So trigonometry. And trigonometry is just the branch of mathematics that deals with the relation between the sides and angles of triangles and the calculations that you do based on those. I hope that you highlighted all those roots. You might go back through and check really quick. There's bar, geo, kilo, gnome, ode, para, ped, peri, sim, tack, try and gone. Okay? Y'all have a great evening. Bye.